What's up guys, it's your Pierce here. We haven't been recording in a long time. Um, but I do have something special for you. This is something that I haven't done before on this channel. We have played the game, but we haven't played this type of game mode on the channel. Um, I'm just going to leave it to you and find out what's going to happen. As you can see, we're playing FIFA. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be the manager for Chelsea. Being the manager for Chelsea is quite important to me because I feel like Chelsea do need a bit of improvements, although they do win the league quite often. I am a Chelsea fan. They do win the league quite often, but um, there's a few players in career mode that, you know, we can change and make this club amazing. So, we've I've already put us into the Champions League this season because, as you know, Chelsea have been in the uh, Champions League this season. We did go get knocked out. But, um, yeah, we're going to get straight into it, and we're going to make a couple signings. Um, this career mode will not, this, play, being the manager for Chelsea will not end until we win any, everything that Chelsea can win. So, I'm talking about the FA Cup, the Champions League, the EFL Cup, the Prem, the Prem, the Prem, the Prem, I think, and the Premier League. I'm not sure if I said that twice, but, uh, you know, everything that we can buy. Transfer talks, our the expectations, I think this is a lot of the youth. The scouts arrived and I think lost the agent. But anyway, let's get straight into the team. The team looks like this right now. Um the formation that we are going to be using is a uh, three four two one. We're going to be keep not a lot of the players that you can see right now are going to be staying. I mean Hazard's staying. Kante I'm gonna keep for as long as I can. But I mean, like, the players on this team that you can see right now, except Hazard, um, they're not going to be going until, you know, they all, until it, unless I get a good offer for all of them. So, Kante, I will sell if we get a big boy offer for him, like, a uh, signing over. I'm not letting Kante go for less than 100 million. I think anyone that asks for that money, I'm going to kick him out the door. So let's quickly get into the two signings that I do want to get before I can uh, sell anyone. We're going to need a striker and we're going to need a good centre mid. I think a centre mid, I think a lot of people have chosen this. Leon Goretzka, I think that's how you say it. Leon Goretzka. There you go. Leon Goretzka plays for Schalke. The thing is that his contract is expiring in 12 months. And this is the problem. If we win everything that we can this year, then we can't sign Goretzka because we won't be at Chelsea next year. Don't forget, guys, when we finish this season or if we complete all the challenges, don't forget to tell me what club you guys want to see me play for next. Um... Uh, there's also a striker. He is a left mid, but he is a person that I like to play at strike with this formation. It's Jung Min Song. Now, I know a lot of you are going to be complaining, or oh, why are you copying other YouTubers? There's a reason why I'm copying other YouTubers for this, for Sun. It's because he's an amazing he's an amazing player. And playing him at Chelsea is just going to make the club even better. So, we're going to quickly go ahead and sign... I'm going to try and sign uh, Son. I'm not someone stupid with the money. I'm going to... Um, this career mode is going to be based on, like, not signing people for crazy amounts of money when you can just buy them for something really cheap. So Son here, his value is 34 million, but uh, uh, Tottenham said we might have... An we might have to offer between 39.4 million and 58.4 million to have a chance at this deal. So we're going to approach and talk to uh, Pochettino. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. Um, right. I'm going to straight up offer 40 million and you can take. And I can take some. They want 63. Can I say. I'm going to go up with on offer. 50 million. 50 million? Right, they still want 63. I'm 
I'm gonna go no more than 60 million. Tottenham's manager says okay, 60 million. I'm kind of disappointed that we had to sign him for that much. I mean, it's gonna lower the chances of me signing Goretzka. Uh, no, he's gonna have to play every game. Alright, so we're five years? Yeah, okay, that should be fine. Um, please, please. Now, last time I signed uh, Sun was. Uh, at another club, and I made this release clause 200 million. After two seasons, a club went and accepted their release clause and bought it for 200 million. I'm gonna stray up off 120 million for his release clause, they want 92. So they're basically asking when Sun does good, he's gonna leave. Now, I think we have something around uh, 69 million. Alright. I'm going to quickly go to the hub and put the players on the market. Courtois is going to go. Eduardo, I don't think I'm ever going to play him. Uh, Moses, I'm going to put him on the market. These players that I'm putting on the market, I'm going to sell them, make more money, and buy players that are going to be amazing for this club. Um, Zuma, I'd like to bring back. David Luiz is going to go. Gary Cahill, he's the leader, but, you know. Right, Aspilicueta, I can make a lot of money off him. Christiansen, especially, is going to make a lot of money. Alonso, I can make a better player. Uh, Bakioka has to stay because of his uh, contract. Kante, make a lot of money off him. Fabregas as well. There's a lot of people that I like to bring back from loan. Um, who else? Pedro, not gonna do well. William as well, I can do nothing. Morata, as I'll stay. Right. I'm gonna quickly put Sun in his position. I'm gonna quickly simulate the first match of this group stage. We're gonna put him into the group stage. We're not. We're not gonna approach Goretzka yet. I think maybe if we can make a bit more money or just after the preseason we'll go to Goretzka. But we're gonna go and advance into a game against Bayern Munich. This game, you might think I'm stupid, but I'm going to simulate. I think maybe if we can simulate this, we can like you know see how the team goes. We're gonna put Trevor Chalaba on loan. If we if we simulate the preseason then we can see how the team goes and see what we can improve on. So, uh, we're going to get into the game against Bayern Munich. What can happen? I really don't want to loss. I'm going to quickly simulate this. And we win 3-0. Moses, William, and Son on his debut. Wow. 3-0 against Bayern Munich. I think Kimmich, looking at the Bayern Munich side, Kimmich is someone that I have to buy maybe next season. Not... I'm going to try and avoid making big boy signings this season, unless I make a lot of money. So people like Dybala, I know if we can stay until next season, then definitely I'm going to bring in Dybala. Anyway, next game against Juventus. We haven't got any offers. Oh, just like just me saying that. We get an offer for Christensen, 32 million from Burnley. Listen, Burnley, I know you can give me a bit more money. You can probably give me like 42 million, 42 million, and you can take Christensen. What would you say? 42 million? They want 32 million, and that's our final offer. Mm. Can you give me 40? 32. I'm happy to let him go for 32, but I know we can get a bit more money for it. Can we say 36? Nope. That's disappointing. What, 4 million extra? 
I mean, I did want to sell him as well. We could have make, made a bit more money. But anyway, we're going to advance into the game against Juventus. Hopefully, we can get another... Oh, Gary Cahill. Spurs. Wow. Tottenham Hotspur. The big boy, Gary Cahill. The captain for Chelsea. Tottenham Hotspur have given in an offer for him. You know what? I'm going to straight up offer. I'm going to say, you know what? You can take him. It is Tottenham. So, I, I highly doubt... I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm probably doubting that. He's actually going to go through and actually accept this. International management. Le loan off. Oh, my bad. Loan offer as well for George. Like, each room? I don't even know how to say it. But we're going to put... The these players are very young. I'm going to put them on loan. Get them back in a couple more seasons. And then we can have some uh, good players. Anyway, getting into the game against Juventus. Obviously, we're going to quickly simulate this. And we are going to win 1-0. Wow. Wow. We've actually beaten Bayern Munich and Juventus in this preseason. I mean, I think it's because we're playing a solid team against, like, I think they're going to be playing their lower team. So, uh, also, we're going to get into a game against LA Galaxy. After this game, oh, what do we have here? Gary Cahill sold. Wow. Gary Cahill has gone to Tottenham Hotspur. I've never... Wow. That is crazy. I'm going to quickly go in for Leon Goretzka. I don't think I'm going to play him until the end of the, uh, the se not the season, end of the preseason. So I'm going to quickly, he's got 53 million release clause. You know what, I'm going to accept this because every time that I go in and sign Goretzka, they say we want 60, we want 70. So buying his release clause and, uh, you know, paying 53 million, I think, is probably cheaper than what would I, what I would have paid if I went into negotiations. Now, he wants his 40k a week normally, so he's a crucial player. He's going to be playing a lot. He wants a five-year contract. I'm just going to accept whatever they want because I don't think really we're going to be staying for five years at Chelsea. 60,000, 20 goals. Goretzka, I think every season he's assisting more than scoring, but he does score a lot of goals. But anyway, Goretzka is signed for Chelsea, and uh, how much money do we have? We have 26 million left. Goretzka joining the team, I think, is going to be better for this uh, preseason. But like I said, I'm probably not going to play him until the season starts. Anyway, we're going to go into. More games. I think we're going to play LA Galaxy right now. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Playing LA Galaxy home in this American Challenge Cup. We win 3-0. 3-0. Wow. I realized Moses and William have scored a lot this preseason. I think William scored every single game. That's Hazard's first goal. And uh, we're doing quite well. I feel like this team... Although it's winning a lot of games, I don't think it'll be that amazing against um, in the Premier League. Loaned out. Cal Scott's got another loan offer. I think we've already put him out on loan. We're going to accept this one as well, just in case the other one doesn't go through. We've got some tournament prize money. Alright. Semi-final. Wow. We've got a couple. Uh... Alright. Christensen. 32 million from Manchester United. Alright. This one. I know Manchester United will pay big boy. I'm going to straight up offer 45 million and you can take this 23 year old. 45 million boys. I know you can do it. Your money right. 40 million. Alright, go on. And they've made it for us. Isaiah Brown, you can go out on loan. I think we're about to go through and. So, Christensen, Carl Scott, both moves have been rejected. Uh, Paris Saint-Germain, I think we should be winning this. 4-0. Wow, not a single loss. And Christian scores, Christensen scores. We're off to the final, mate. I think that's, uh, that's very, against, against Bayern Munich. Come on, boys. We beat them 3-0 in the beginning of the season. I'm going to praise Bayern Munich. 
Alright. Well, I'm gonna simulate this again. And, um, I'm pretty sure we're gonna get this win. I mean, if we don't, it'll be disappointing, but... Yeah, 1 0. Wow. Courtois does have an injury, though, which means if it's a long one, no one will buy him. Which is a problem, because if we don't have a keeper, we're going to have to stick with Caballero. And I'm not willing into, I'm not willing to buy a keeper. Alright, let's quickly see. About seven days. Alright, that shouldn't be bad. Not bad at all. Tournament prize money. We have received all the money that we can win from this tournament. We have now in our office 37 million. Also, the other 30. Also, the other 40 million that's coming in from Christensen could get us a few more signings for this new for this for our next game against Arsenal and the Community Shield. All right, we're gonna quickly simulate into this. We asked Andres Christensen is gone. Now, this is the time where we have to start sorting out the team and start actually spending the money. Fabregas is gonna go out for. Oh, Fabregas is going to go out for Goretzka. And now you can see how the team is starting to form. The back I'm going to try. You know, I'm not going to worry about it too much. Now, the only problems we do have is Alonso and Moses. Alonso and Moses are the people that I want to get rid of as soon as possible. Because uh, I know it's going to take a bit of time getting rid of them. So, instead of uh, Alonso... Um, there's someone that I know is going to be crazy and probably the least realistic, un the most unrealistic signing that Chelsea will ever do. And boys, this is Jesse Lingard. Jesse Lingard is crazy in career mode. I know you might not agree with me, but in my opinion, this boy is solid. 24 years of age, a cam, he fits very well in, in Chelsea. Now... I'm pretty sure he has a release clause. Nope, he doesn't. So I'm going to quickly offer 30... 30? I'm going to go to 25. I do not want... I don't want him to disagree with him. I'm going to quickly go up to 24. Don't. 28. Come on, Mourinho. 24. 25. Are you serious? 100k more? My days. This is the thing. EA needs to fix this. 100k more for one player is stupid. I know 100k is a lot of money in real life, but when it comes to clubs and signing players, 100k is nothing. Wow, that's quite annoying. Anyway, let's get into negotiations with Jesse Lingard and his agent. His squad row is going to be very important. He's an, he's an important player. I can't guarantee that he will play every single game, but I know he's going to be playing a lot of games. Yes, I don't think we can play any people to go to the final. I'm going to just say 6 in the game. Let's reach. He gets something like, I think, I'm going to quickly offer like... Offer 100,000 a week. You say 21,000 and 5 after 460,000. Five goals. That is good. I mean, now the team's starting to form, and I really can't wait to get into the Premier League because I want to see how this play, how this team plays a lot of football. And it's going to be exciting. Anyway, guys, we're going to quickly wait for a couple more offers. So we can start this season well, well, and you know, get more players. I think, like, if anything, right now, I just want to sell Moses and William and bring in someone like Sterling and um, who else? Sterling, Dybala. But those people I won't buy till next season. That's what's annoying. So someone like Riyad Mahrez would be good if I can bring him in now. That'd be alright. I mean, I don't really mind Riyad Mahrez. Riyad Mahrez, uh, I think he's he's one of the most. He is a really overpowered um, right mid in career mode. It's kind of strange that in one type of mode in in, in FIFA, 
a player is different to another one. So I think some so, so like um like Pulisic. I signed him in my last career mode. He wasn't that great. Although he did go to a really high rating, he wasn't great. But whereas if I played in kickoff with Pulisic, he's quite good. He is really strange. Anyway, we're gonna quickly go ahead and try and f bring in Mares. I'm not willing to s spend over 40 million on Mares. Yeah, Mares. His value is 29. Like I said, I'm not paying more than 40 million for him. If they offer more than 40, I'm gonna say GG. See you later. Let's see what happens. So I'm going to go straight to 30 That's my final offer here. Yeah? 38. And then that drops. I'm not paying more than 38. If anything, I wasn't willing to pay more than 35. Uh, all right, the Arsenal game's coming up in a few days. Mara's unacceptable. They want 39. You know what? I'll see. All right, then. Mara's, let's bring you in, man. All right, what's going to happen here? Important player. Yeah, right. That works out. Um, I'm going to say three years. I mean, I'm not willing to keep him more than three years. Like I said, with these times, with the, with the time that I keep these players for, I'm not really interested in it because I'm probably, I'm going to try and win everything this season. 17 million reviews for us, all right? Right. some time are you serious 200 pounds off are you dumb oh my days this is I this has never happened to me before contract un unacceptable are you stupid you don't have the financial oh man after con oh my this is stupid Move bonus. Yeah, move that. <sighs> wow, fifty pounds. What? That's that is crazy. We reduced his his. What he wants by fifty pounds, and we freaking sign Morris. That is probably my bad, guys. The stupidest signing I've ever done in my entire life. Now we have we have two hundred pounds in the bank for Chelsea. This is really stupid. Wow, I really regret that. That is stupid as. Sorry guys for the party notifications that are going on right now. Alright, we're gonna get into an Arsenal game. I'm gonna simulate this one and then I'll end the video there. Anyway. I think it's been I don't think it's been that much of a great start for the career mode. I mean the stupid signing for Mares. I think it's 
one of the stupidest things I've ever done. But anyway, we've got something coming up right now. I think it's a couple of transfer offers. Loan offer for Antonio Rudiger. That is stupid. No way. No way. Must be stupid. Alright. We're gonna simulate this. Honestly, I'm not too worried if we use this. Because, um. They went on penalties. Happened this year as well. What can I do? I mean, anyway. FA Community Shield. Arsenal 2, Chelsea 2. Arsenal won 4 3 on penalties. Wow. Anyway, guys, I know it's not been that much of a great start to the career mode, but I promise you this career mode is going to be amazing, and I promise you guys, you guys are going to really enjoy it. Anyway, guys, don't forget to smash the like button. Hope you guys enjoyed, and your your plays is out.